It's hard to miss the smile. Dylan Ennis wears it like a favorite shirt. And it comes naturally, like the basketball skills that he's shown since he was a kid and since he arrived on the main line. But natural ability is only part of a complete basketball player. Not an easy lesson for a gifted athlete to learn. I used to be small, and then, you know, one summer I just got all my athletic ability and grew at the same time. So, you know, it's hard to control that because, you know, you want to do everything. You know, you want to, you know, be fast. You want to jump high. But, you know, coming here, I think Coach was able to control everything I do. Hey, Dylan, pull the ball out. If we're in a two-point game, you got to make the decision to pull the ball out. You're a point. Hey, Dylan, that's what a point guard does. My athletic ability is great, but, you know, you can't do anything with the athletic ability if you're not smart. I think being here, you know, coach taught me how to be a smarter player and, you know, putting those two together, you know, it's crazy. But for Ennis, the road to crazy meant ignoring the lure of another summer playing international basketball to absorb all he could about what his team needed from him. And it meant staying at Villanova. To make a team contacted me, actually, to play again. And, you know, I sat down with coach and I, you know, thought about, you know, staying here. You know, we thought it was best for me to, you know, pick up on the team concepts and, you know, learn the Villanova way. You know, I've been here for two years prior to this year, but, you know, you always can learn more. And, you know, I thought this summer was big for me to, you know, find out, you know, what coach wanted from me and, you know, coach putting that pressure on me to um, know that they're going to rely on me this year and, you know, finding what I had to do to, you know, be successful this year, but through the summer. I, I think he just had a a great working mentality uh, the whole off season and, and just a consistency to it, you know, in the gym every day, just regularly working. And I think when a kid does that, you want for him to feel like there is, there is a reward. There is, there is something to be said for all the work he put in every day. That reward, Dylan's first Wildcat start in the season opener. We know we have seven, eight guys on this team that could start in our league. But, but for him, I think it is just one of the little things that, that validates the work he put in. The bright lights and big stage of opening night. A perfect place to get a first look at how far Ennis had come. Cats come up with a steal. Hillier down court to Ennis. Ennis ahead of the pack. Throws down a one-handed jam in transition. Ennis scored 19 points, his highest total in a Wildcat uniform. He also helped spark the defense to an amazing 31 points off turnovers and showed the mental toughness to help put the game away. Ennis way out on the left wing. Shot fake, fires, and buries a three, and that could be the dagger of this game. Cats by 8, 313 to go. Ennis delivers from the left wing. Over the last years, he just kept at it, kept grinding kept uh, getting in here for film and, and, and watching himself and, and just developing that uh, mentality to be a Villanova guard. It's, uh, you know, playing together and playing, you know, unselfish. You know, I never, you know, played on a team that was, you know, so tight like this one, you know. No disrespect to my other teams, but, you know, coach does a great job in making sure everybody plays their roles because all the players know exactly, you know, what we have to do, you know, to win, but do it together. Ennis is arguably the Wildcats' best on-ball defender, another individual talent that's becoming part of a bigger picture. There's parts of the team defense that he's still in the process of learning, and he's getting better at it every day. I mean, he's, he's miles ahead of where he was at the end of last year in terms of understanding our team defense, and I think midway through this season, he'll be even further ahead. Now they give it to Keith Wilson. Wilson went high, and Ennis went higher. That was an incredible block shot, and as clean as could be. What an athletic player. Those types of highlight film plays seem to follow the family name. Last season, Dylan got the rare opportunity to face off against his younger brother, Tyler, when the Wildcats faced Syracuse. Then in June, he had a front row seat as his brother was selected by the Phoenix Suns in the NBA draft. Everybody said it looked like I enjoyed it more than he did. <laughs> um, you know, it's always been our dream, you know, when we were growing up. And um, he doesn't show his emotions as much as I do. You know, I'm always the smiling one, and he's the quiet one. Um, but, you know, I think that's why we're great. We balance each other out. But, you know, it was a great experience. And um, 
everything about it was perfect. You know, I felt like I was the one getting drafted because we're so close. Professional ball is the long-term goal. Great job! For now, Ennis just keeps getting better. Great job by Dylan. That's the plays we got to make, what Jeez. Dylan did, right? And looking for a way to make that killer smile part of his game. You know, off the court, I'm always smiling. I can't help it. But he taught me that, you know, when people see you, they want to see the fire in your eyes. And when you see me on the court, you know, I might not smile a lot, but it's because I'm determined. You know, I want to win. You know, I want to make sure that I make that dive and play. I want to get that steal to win the game, the defensive stop. But if you see me smiling, you know, it's a, it's a smile to put fear in other people. You know, make them know that, you know, I'm, I'm enjoying this. You know, I'm, I'm still going to kill you, but I'm enjoying doing it. A great accomplishment by a, a really special young man to, to get himself into the starting lineup and become really a Villanova guard uh, from transferring. And, and it's not an easy thing to do. I think everyone in our program has great respect for, for Dylan off the court in, in his personality, his commitment to academics, but most importantly, how he's adjusted his game and learned how to take all of that talent and become a great Villanova guard.